Hey guys, it is Adrian, and it is Saturday, which means it's weigh-in day, and I have good news to report this week. I have lost three more pounds, which means I am at 241, and I'm happy with that. Um, I had a rough start to my week. I didn't. I was not feeling hot at all. Um, in fact, um, I had a migraine, and I normally don't get migraines except for around lilies, and I was near no lilies. I know when I'm near lilies. I smell them. <laughs> it's like I do not like lilies. I think they're beautiful, but I don't want to be anywhere near them ever. Like, go out of my way to avoid them, not near them. Um, yeah, but uh, I don't know what caused it this time, but uh, I am back to normal now, and I'm happy about that. Uh, I think that my takeaways are that I'm really proud of myself this week for food because when I don't feel so hot, I tend to go crazy with food. Like most people don't eat when they don't feel good, right? Uh, that's not me. <laughs> I eat everything, everything. And then I munch, um, but I haven't done any of the munching. I've been sticking to um, my meals and my snacks and that's it. And I'm happy with that. And clearly it shows because I'm pretty sure I wouldn't have had a loss otherwise because uh, normally on weeks I'm sick, some people lose crazy weight and then I don't lose anything. In fact, I'm more likely to gain because I eat <laughs> and I didn't do that this week. I was really conscious of that and um, I'm not doing my walks the same. Uh, it is Arizona, which means it's 106, 108, 110 <laughs> during the day, which means after dark, it's also over 100 and I lose interest in being anything but an indoor pet after that. So. For you people who still go out there and run, you go. <laughs> but I'm okay doing my workouts inside. I need to start using my treadmill more and have a tread climber. I need to start using it more. But I've just been doing like aerobic stuff inside. And uh, I'm okay with my workouts. They're not uber fantastic, but uh, they're getting the job done. So uh, I'm okay with that. I'm okay doing them. And I don't feel like I'm slacking. So I'm happy with all that. Uh, the one thing I think I need to take away from this week is I don't think I've been getting enough water. Uh, I drink, normally I drink, uh, these are, it's a boss bottle, I reuse them. Uh, they're 28.74 ounces, I just call them 28 ounces even though they're close to 29. But normally I dr should probably be drinking four of these at least, if not more, before my workout. Um, but I've been drinking about three to four of them a day, even including the workout. So um, I think I need to up that. And yeah, I'll drink more if I'm thirsty, but like I've been really busy this week and I haven't been feeling so hot. So I think I've been poorly compensating as far as the beverages go. I've been drinking too much soda and not enough water. So need to change that this week. And I don't think I'm getting my stretches in as well as I could have. So I need to do, I need to up that and start doing the yoga stretches again. I felt myself slacking a little on that. So it's such a weird balancing act, right? I am perfectly happy with this week. I'm happy with my way in. I am happy with my workouts and my food. Um, I just think it's a strange balancing act, act to make sure everything's fine. Uh, you check the boxes, right? Because otherwise I start falling short in one area and then it, it snowballs on me. And then I end up screaming at myself one week for doing something amazingly stupid and getting four pounds. So it's all about schedule for me. It really is. And just sticking to it. It's not never having cheat balls or never having cake. It's not, it's not about that for me. It's really just about consistency throughout the week. And then if say today is my day, I'm going to go crazy. I can go have that large cheese ball at Culver's. I can do that. And that's fine with me. But uh, during the week, I I seem way happier if I just stick to a schedule. I stick to routine. And interestingly, I do not care what I eat for breakfast and lunch ever. I just don't. I can probably eat the same thing every day for the rest of my life, except for wild hair in the morning and the lunch. At night, I care. But I've been cooking. Um, I made some grilled shrimp. I learned how to grill shrimp this week because Google and how I learned to cook Google. And yeah, does Food Network still play cooking shows? 
I feel competitions now. I used to watch cooking shows. Now it's competitions. Anyway, other good news. Because this, people, is good news. One, I had to take in all of my bras one notch. Uh, my 44s had to go in a notch, like on hooks, which is always really exciting for me because my straps fall down. And I found out after looking on the internet because I couldn't figure out why they were falling down because usually taking the bra in is never something I have to do. So it's not something I would have, I'm like, why are my bra straps falling down? This is stupid because my bra is too big. Yeah. So, um, <laughs> but uh, this right here, this shirt, I've had in my closet for a while and I got it from Torrid. But it is a 2X, not 3X, a 2X. And uh, it's a little tight in the arms, but everywhere else, I'm happy with it. I'm like, I'm happy with it around my stomach. I'm happy with it around the chest. I got a little room in the chest. And uh, of course, I have room in the chest. Anyway, <laughs> but uh, I'm very happy about that. <laughs> In fact, I'm really happy about going into a 2X and being able to fit into this stuff. I got a couple of shirts from them uh, not that long ago, and uh, they're all 2Xs, and they've been sitting in my closet. The 16s are all fitting pretty well, except for the one pair that's an actual 16 versus a vanity size 16. And uh, I don't know, man, the going down in clothing size for me is huge because it's a weird feeling, <laughs> but it's a happy feeling. I am getting closer, getting closer to fitting into normal clothing, which means I have options and I'll still probably shop at Torrid until I can't. And I'm okay with that. <laughs> I think it will be a while. I don't drink that fast, but I'm happy. I'm happy. So yeah, so here's to feeling better and three pounds loss and knowing what I need to do to improve things next week. So. I hope you're all having a fantastic week and I'll talk to you later. Bye.